Hey friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'll be giving you 30 things to do when you're bored at home. Volleyball edition. I know a lot of us are trying to stay safe and healthy, but we also need ideas on creative ways to stay entertained and having fun. So these are all volleyball related. I'm giving you 30 ideas. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you try one of them. Teaching someone to pepper. We're checking how you look. You look cute, babe. Teaching someone to pepper who doesn't know how to pepper can be a challenge, fun for you. Know pepper. Fun, yeah, do you know how to pepper? Yeah. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. Okay, how do you even hold a platform? Uh, thumb over thumb, boom. What, wait, what is all this lag? This is a lot of fingers sticking out. I need it like equal. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> okay. Feel it, get in there. Let me see you pass, babe. It feels deep, it feels like I have a whole hole no, right there. So match your thumbs together. Yeah, there we go. Okay, right. nice and straight. That's not bad. You're gonna do this? Yeah. I mean, bad. I'm not even, I'm not the best at it. Um, yeah. Can I see? Okay, come in, ready? Yep. Nice! You have to roll shot it or hit it, so right, we're gonna pepper. That's above my level. No, you got it. <gasps> oh! oh! Too much power! <laughs> Anyways, it's fun stuff. One of the best parts of club volleyball tournaments is when you don't have games and you have snack time. So let's see what we have here that brings me nostalgia. Obviously pretzel crisps. I feel like that is clearly at every volleyball tent. Peanut butter Nutella life is something as well. I'm gonna go with some pretzel crisps. This makes me feel like um, I'm waiting to play a game. My diehard supporters will know that I am in fact on the old TikTokular app. I just joined it. Well, that's not true. I joined it a, a while ago, but I could not figure out how to use it for the longest time. It's fun how much of a volleyball community there is on TikTok. So let's look up some videos. It's hard to even pick one. Oh, I've seen this one. I want to do it, but I feel like I'm, I'm way too late to the trend. Okay, I'm gonna do the one with the beat because I just said it and it's the only idea I have right now. Warm up, this is a warm up. Shoot, I hit 10 seconds. I hate when I do that, but I just gotta go with it. Can't hear it, fail. You guys, this is so hard, I can't even figure out when to start. It's been an embarrassing amount of time. However, I have an entire vlog to finish, so I posted something to TikTok, hashtag real post, check it out. There are some amazing books that really, really ow, helped me with volleyball. One of those books was this book called Mindset by Carol Dweck. Everyone should own this book. It says it on the cover. Here are some other books that I like if you wanna try those out too. If you just wanna sit there and listen, podcasts are awesome. I love podcasts. Fun fact, your girl has a podcast. And I've actually had on so many volleyball players. Carrie Walsh, April Ross, Nicole Davis, Rachel Adams. Go check out their stories, type in RealPod on iTunes or Spotify, and listen to a podcast. Hi. Hi. You guys, we have Cinder Albania here. Hey guys, I just got out of class. I saw this tweet and it like made me think of us. It was like, after this is all over, invite me out. Like, I promise I'll go to this. <laughs> Why is that literally us? <laughs> Okay, love you and I'll text you later. Bye vlog. Bye. I'm slightly scared for this one. I just don't think it's really the move. Oh my God, I have an idea. Oh my God, hi. But what do I owe this pleasure? Well, actually you are right. There is a cost of this call. <laughs> I figured that to be the case. <laughs> I'm filming a vlog called things to do when you're bored at home and one of them is FaceTime your coach and you're the only person who has remotely coached me who I knew wouldn't be so unwelcoming of this FaceTime. What's up people? The biggest bummer is like the Olympics being postponed but the fact that it's postponed and not canceled is nice. Yeah. It's, it's, it's like not out of the picture. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, it's just weird. Um, I'll text you if anything happens in my life that I think you should know. <laughs> I'm sure you will. A lot of my volleyball stuff, just kidding, literally all of it, is in our 
attic. This portion is my section. You can see these are my bags. Here I have my shoes from senior year. And I have my like warm up jackets, you guys. I have so much stuff. And then in here, oh wow, that's where my sweatshirt is. Right now as you're bored at home, it's a good opportunity to go through your volleyball bags, your backpack, ooh, a backpack, woo and see what you don't need or what you do need. I'm actually not gonna go through it now because, spoiler, I'm making a video where I go through all of this stuff. Too soon? Something you can do in addition to just listing the goals is come down, ooh, no come down here and then break it down. So how am I gonna master my jump flow? And you can kind of break down how you're gonna do each of these things and then I bet you'll feel super organized and super motivated when you write it down on paper. This is so tedious and takes so much time to do that right now while you're at home, you should be gathering your film if you have it. I do wanna piggyback this tip with my next tip because the two of them go hand in hand. To make it even easier for you guys, I made a video titled, How to Email College Coaches, which explains how to cut your film, go through it and prepare it. Right now, you have so much time to do it. So yesterday I was FaceTiming one of my old teammates, Brie, for the first time in like ever. So I'm gonna send her a nice text right now, just saying how much I loved the FaceTime and talking to her. I don't have any temporary tattoos I could put on. However, I have a Sharpie and I have my imagination. So I'm just gonna draw on myself. This one was clearly a stretch. What? That's low-key such a good circle. This is going well. Oh no. Nope. All right. Well, it's kind of cute and trendy. Wait, I've literally always wanted to use this sound. I feel like Emma Chamberlain. It's so hard to think of a favorite game, but something that comes to mind immediately, and I know it's on YouTube, is the first game I ever played against UCLA my freshman year 2015. We played at Poly Pavilion, we swept them in three, and I'll show you how the game ended. This is why it was my favorite game. <laughs> Wait, let me set the scene. <laughs> I'm a freshman walk-on. My whole family is there. It is my first ever conference game. We are playing rivals, the Bruins. Okay, that's all you need to know. Zoom back in. We get game point. I was a defensive specialist, so I get subbed in. Game point. <laughs> I look like such a baby. Yeah, so that was probably like one of the absolute highlights of my volleyball career. Okay, I'm about to tell you an embarrassing secret. As most of you know, USC Volleyball was my absolute dream school, and their libero when I was in high school was a girl named Natalie Hagland. She was packed to a libero of the year. She has the most total digs of anyone at USC. This <laughs> is so embarrassing. At club tournaments. To get like hyped up would want to watch her serve, receive, and defense highlights because it would just be like, okay, that's how good I want to be. That's who I want to be. Like, that's where I want to play. So I'm going to pull up and see if I can find the clip I used to watch of her. Okay, it's the first one. Yeah, she's in the white here. And I would just watch, like, she is so freaking good. Watch this. What? What, what, what? Watching videos of yourself is probably the most productive thing you could do because you would be seeing ways you could get better. So I have pulled up some old footage of me playing. I found this game versus Stanford. I figured that this would be good for critiquing myself because Stanford's so good. So the chances are I probably did some stuff wrong. Okay, so I serve to the libero. So that was already bad. I have already put my team in a disadvantage. Then I get in base. This is a good base position. That's me in the white. 
and then I'm shuffling, shuffling over to the right. That ball graces my head and lands inbounds here. Had I not have shuffled in, the reason I probably did that, if you noticed, that was Catherine Plummer who was hitting and she is unreal good. So I think I had this inside need of like, she's gonna bounce the ball, so I need to run in and dig it. But really, I should have been in base. We can end on a good one for some positive vibes. Ooh, roof, 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 roof. There's sadly not a ton of options for like volleyball movies and shows. Back of the net feel, oh no, that's a soccer movie. Haiku. Okay, do I have to watch that? Because everyone comments on my videos and I have no idea what they're talking about, but this is what they're talking about. <gasps> I should watch Haiku. If you guys saw my last video, you know one of my favorite things to say is play with yourself. So if you are interested in learning the six tips I have for that, you can check that video out. This is a fun one, just like one of those. Remember when dot dot daughter would rather be here than in quarantine. I mean, who's to judge? Whatever's gonna make you happy. It's fun to look through your old pictures too and post them. I'm gonna put one on my story. Oh my God, you guys, baby Vic. I was an outside, how cute. Hashtag TBT, hashtag baby Vic. This one's pretty easy and you can go on like literally any social media app. It's just entertaining. Hashtag volleyball at home. Oh, hashtag volleyball at home is trending. So if you wanna get some ideas, you can check this out. Oh my God, this is so precious. Carrie Walsh is playing her son. I have this little baby ball and it's so cute. It's like a little marshmallow, but it would be really fun to get some arts and crafts, glue and glitter or paint or stickers and decorate a volleyball. Oh my gosh, you guys. There's a little sticker that says make it happen. That's one of my favorite things to say, make it happen. Look, it's like the SC is saying, make it happen, make your dreams happen. Stressed, blessed, and volleyball obsessed. If that's not a mood, but okay, we're saving that inspirational quote. It's not how good you are, it is how good you want to be. I love this. I'm already getting inspired just by doing this. And then you have your own little board where you have all your quotes that you can keep gathering. And you guys know I love my quotes. I have a ton of volleyball pictures in my phone. If I just search volleyball, they come up. And I think there's like a million memes you can make. When my boyfriend brings me food. Okay, good ones of teammates. Oh. <laughs> If you guys want to get really crafty with it, you can open up, an, open up an app. Okay, this is cute. This is a cute meme. Wait, I forgot you guys. Rennie sent me one the other day. It is me, her, and Kalia standing in line with our faces just like shook. So if you can come up with a meme for this, comment it down below. So my sweet mother made me this scrapbook over the years. This is my first volleyball team ever. Look how cute she is. She put these stickers in. You're so sweet. Oh, there's my girl. I know. Oh my gosh. Who is she? She believed in you. <laughs> Dwight That was my first you. coach. And you weren't even on a team. He called me and they said they wanted you for the middle. Oh, on 14 threes. So my mom kept all of these for me. Oh, anytime I was mentioned in the paper, she kept it. So many old pictures and memories. Something special to okay. carry Okay. Senior year, look at some of these. Do you remember those? Yeah, team dinner. Oh my gosh, she screenshotted Instagram, so that's so cute. Freshman year, what a little fetus. Oh, I am definitely no longer bored. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching the whole thing. Please, if you enjoyed it, comment down below 
which of the 30 ideas was your favorite. I'm curious to know. Make sure you don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will see you in my next video. Thanks again, and I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day.